When I think about what more can we do, what more can, can I do for this community, how can I better um, help affect this community, it's always thinking about you know, how best to go about um, this idea of 1% better every day. And if I'm thinking 1% better every day, as we're marching, as we're holding signs, as, as you see some of these leaders talking the way they do, it's that idea that it's not a us versus them, it's, it, it can possibly be a we. And that's what we're fighting for. The Saints' Cam Jordan and the NFL recognize the vital importance of improving police community relations. That priority has led the NFL to seek out organizations who use empirical data to lay the framework for change, like CPE, the Center for Policing Equity. My name is Philip T. Begoff. I am the co-founder and the CEO of the Center for Policing Equity, CPE for short. The Center for Policing Equity was informally established um, in about 2005. That was in response to a bunch of scientists trying to figure out how to do science to identify where there was racism in the front end of our criminal legal systems. So CPE is set up as a tool for communities that want to change the way that public safety is, is delivered to them. And we provide for them a set of science-guided pathways that they could take to secure public safety differently. You've got communities that feel like they can't trust law enforcement. What they can trust is a process that's led by science and by their own values. And what we'll do is we'll work with local activists, local electeds, and local law enforcement to say, what is the solution that you all want us to do that are responsive to the local values? So we set up the table where we can talk about how we go forward. We set up the process you can trust when you can't trust each other. But police can do something about the things that are left over in that equation. And the thing that I think might surprise folks who have seen the stories and the unspeakable tragedies, particularly the last five years, is when we bring those data to law enforcement, they are eager to do something about it. So the NFL has been incredibly generous um, with a significant cash donation to us that they said, use this to do whatever of the work you need to. So some places will come in and they have an interest of really promoting their own brand. The NFL said, here is uh, resources. We've used that to work in places to reimagine public safety. I choose to see positivity in the ideas that we're creating a forward momentum of what we think our policing entity should be and hopefully create a, a positive ripple. I don't find this to be a complete solution to this. I don't find it to be a, this is the answer for everything, but I do think that this is a step forward and how hopefully it'll inspire a little bit of hope towards community police relations. Through work with its grant partners like CPE, the NFL has the tools to continue building a foundation for meaningful change. And while players like Cam Jordan understand the scope of the challenge, they can also foresee a more promising and equitable future.